Hi, I'm John Jacobson from Navtech, and today we're going to talk about innovations in aircraft corrosion prevention. A little bit about me, I've been in the aerospace industry for about 15 years in a variety of different roles. Currently, I'm the, the manager of Avdex Commercial Aerospace Group, overseeing a group of representatives that are working with the, the airlines, the OEMs, the MROs, and the business jet operators to help solve some of their unique corrosion issues. Here's the uh, agenda for today's tech talk. We'll talk about corrosion basics. We'll talk about common aircraft corrosion areas and solutions to help prevent corrosion in those areas. We'll talk about antennas, fuel panels, wet area floor beams, seat tracks, engine lip skins on parked aircraft, which is relevant right now due to the COVID-19 epidemic and a lot of airplanes uh, being grounded. And then we'll also talk about quick curing injectable sealants. Here's a little bit of an overview of Avdec if you're not familiar with us. We're based in Fort Worth, Texas. We're highly focused on corrosion prevention in the aerospace industry. All of our solutions feature non-hazardous, easy to install, polyurethane-based gaskets, rolled sealants, quick curing injectable sealants, and sprayable sealants. We have product on pretty much everything that flies from commercial, military, business jets, and helicopters. We'll start off first with a little corrosion basics. What is corrosion? Corrosion is a deterioration of metals resulting be between a reaction between those metals and their environments. You know, it has a white powdery appearance to it. You know, some of the common forms of corrosion are galvanic, pitting, fretting, general surface, microbial, which typically occurs in your fuel tanks, intergranule, stress corrosion cracking. There's some necessary conditions you need for corrosion to start. You need an electrochemical reaction. You need two different materials that have a different electrical potential, an anode and a cathode. You need a presence of an electrolyte or a solution that can transfer that current between the anode and cathode and then you need a conductive connection between the anode and cathode. So the anode and cathode need to be touching each other. Some of your common electrolytes are salt spray, condensation, rinse water, and rain. Another thing to note is the conductivity of the electrolyte is gonna increase when it's combined with salt, acidic gas, engine exhaust, and zert. So that's why you might notice uh, some more severe corrosion in certain parts of the airplane. Here we have the galvanic scale. At the top of the galvanic scale, we have our anode materials. Those are more likely to corrode. At the bottom of the galvanic scale, you have your cathode materials. Those are less likely to corrode. When you have uh, two materials that are next to each other, if they're farther apart on the galvanic scale, you have a higher likelihood of corrosion, having corrosion on that anode material. So you'll see at the top of the, the galvanic scale, we have you know, magnesium, uh, some of your different aluminum alloys, your 775s, your 2024s. At the bottom of the scale, we have your titaniums, your carbon fiber, your stainless steel. All those materials are commonly used on aircraft. If you have uh, carbon fiber next to an untreated or unprotected aluminum alloy in the, the presence of an electrolyte, you have all the necessary conditions to, to start that galvanic corrosion. Here's some of the common corrosion causes. It could be your aircraft design, you know, possibly dissimilar materials, you know, the anode and cathode material that we talked on the previous slide, you know, poor drainage, a lack of lubrication. You know, maybe uh, it's your maintenance process, you know, no formal CPC program, uh, an improper repair, you know, poor inadequate training. You know, you could have accidental contamination, you know, maybe a blue juice spill in your lavatory or a chemical spill um, if you're flying around fish in your cargo area, you know, some of that salt water, you know, that's going to be highly corrosive. And then a big one's, you know, protective coating deterioration. You know, once you get degradation in your, your protective coating, you know, your top coats or your primers, you know, you're, there's a good chance some of that corrosion is going to start. And then also your, you know, your marine, you know, your operating environment. Are you operating in a marine or tropical environment? You know, are you flying through uh, industrial pollutants? You know, the changes in temperatures, you know, as that aircraft goes from, 
know, the ground to altitude and back, you know, are you getting some condensation that's getting trapped? You know, that trapped water can start to lead to some corrosion. Here's an overview of some of Abdex's innovative corrosion prevention products. We do high-tech antenna gaskets, sprayable sealants, injectable sealants, high-tech polyurethane rolled sealants, high-tech fuel panel gaskets, and connector sealing. We'll talk a little bit more about some of these products on the upcoming slides, and there's uh, more information about all these products on uh, Abdex's website as well. First, I want to talk about an antenna corrosion. Once you get uh, corrosion on your antenna, you start to get degradation in performance. You might get some uh, static in your comms or maybe an erroneous reading on your, your radio altimeter. What Abdec offers to help prevent corrosion on the, the antennas is a high-tech polyurethane gasket. If you've ever seen the blue gel antenna gaskets before, you know, those are the Abdec gaskets. It's got an aluminum carrier for bonding of less than two and a half milliohms. Around that aluminum is a very tacky polyurethane gel. That polyurethane is going to provide a really good environmental seal to help prevent any moisture ingress getting underneath that antenna and structure and will help prevent the, the corrosion from starting. The antenna gaskets are die cut to the shape of the antenna and they're, they're pretty much apply and fly for easy installation. Aptex got a, antenna gaskets for most of the different antennas out there. All you need to do is send us the antenna part number and then we can cross-reference the corresponding Abdec gasket part number. At the top here, we have a picture of a, an antenna that did not have an Abdec gasket. Next to it, we have a picture of a Wi-Fi antenna that did have an Abdec antenna gasket. You can see after six years with that Abdec antenna gasket installed, that face of that antenna looks pretty much brand new. Next, I want to talk about floor beam corrosion on your lab, galley, and cargo areas. You know, during a heavy check, the cost of corrosion to repair or replace you know, aircraft floor beams or C-tracks can be very expensive, you know, sometimes anywhere from you know, $10,000 to $50,000. What Abdec offers to help prevent corrosion on the, the, the floor, floor beams is our high-tech polyurethane rolled sealant. It's going to provide a very good environmental seal so it's gonna help prevent moisture and gas uh, on those floor beams. You know, under compression, that high-tech gel is gonna do a really good job of sealing that irregular surface so no moisture gets under and corrosion doesn't start to build. The, the polyurethane rolled sealant's easy to install. It comes in a 12-foot roll. You just roll it right on the floor beam. It also comes in different lifts, depending on you know, the, the size and width of your floor beam. It's easy to install, no special tooling to put it down. And then when you go to remove it, it, you know, it doesn't require any special equipment to get it removed. You're just gonna pull it off and then a little isopropyl alcohol and your, uh, your beams will clean up real nicely. It comes in a flame retardant material and a couple different variations. We have sticky on one side and then we have uh, double-sided sticky as well. Next, I wanna talk about seat track corrosion. Seat track corrosion is also very common when that airplane comes in for a heavy check. You know, a lot of times there's seat track installed, you know, underneath your wet areas. You know, there's no seats there, but you still have that track. If that tra track's left unprotected, when that airplane comes in for a heavy check, you might be in for a nasty surprise with uh, some corrosion there. What Abdec offers is our self-leveling green sealant to help protect that seat track. It's a, a two-part injectable sealant. When you put it down, it's gonna self-level over the seat track. It's uh, really easy to install. And then it's also easy to remove when that airplane comes in for its heavy check and you need to do the inspection. It's got real high cohesion. So it's gonna come off in uh, nice clean strips. So you see at the top, we have a, a picture of the self-leveling green sealant installed. At the bottom, we have a, an aircraft after it came back from a heavy check. You can see on the ends where the self-leveling green was installed that that track looks nice and clean. In the center there, the self-leveling green wasn't installed. You can see there's uh, some contaminants and uh, corrosion there. You can also note that that material, when it came off, it came off in a nice clean strip. So there's not gonna be a, a lot of, you know, scraping uh, different chunks of uh, material. Next, I wanna talk about fuel panel corrosion. Fuel panels and wind planks 
are susceptible to both galvanic and fretting corrosion. Also, fuel panels might have issues with uh, leaks, which can be a, an expensive and time-consuming repair. What Avdec offers is a high-tech fuel panel gasket. It's got Avdec's high-tech fuel-resistant gel on it, surrounded with an aluminum mesh for conductivity and lightning. That, that polyurethane gel is going to fill the voids. It's going to help provide a, a really good environmental seal. The, uh, the Avdec gasket doesn't require any re-greasing. It's available for the, the Boeing aircraft and other aircraft types as well. Next, I want to talk about engine lip skin corrosion. A lot of aircraft are being parked due to the COVID-19 epidemic. Typically, when that aircraft's parked, you want to pr protect that engine lip skin from, from getting corrosion on it. Typically, you'll put a, either a caulk cover or a plastic wrap on it. What some airlines are starting to discover is corrosion on that lip skin. What happens is the, the moisture can get trapped underneath that plastic or in that cover. You see here we have a, a picture of a, a plastic wrap engine with some, some moisture collecting underneath it. If that engine lip skin is not protected, you know, there's a high likelihood you might get some corrosion. What Avdec offers is our SF2470 sealant. It's going to provide a, a durable watertight seal. It can be brushed on for real easy installation. It only needs to be applied one time, so you don't have to go back and, and keep reapplying it. And then similar to the other Avdec products, it has real high cohesion. So when you go to remove the, the 2470, it's going to come off in nice clean strips. So it's not going to require a, a, a bunch of scraping and, and polishing. Next, I want to talk about quick curing injectable sealants. One of the frustrating things is you get your maintenance done, but you can't dispatch because you're waiting on your sealant to cure. You know, some sealants may take anywhere from uh, nine to 10 hours to, to cure. What Avdec offers is a, a fast curing two hour Thixo Black TG3212 sealant or fillet sealant. It's non-hazardous, so you don't need any special hazmat paperwork to ship it, which that kind of comes in handy when you have an AOG. Some of the, the places where it can be installed, you know, antennas, windows, panels, lights, leading edges. It can be used for uh, temporary fuel leak repairs on the external part of the, the fuel tank. We have uh, some pictures of the TG3212 installed on the 737 window at the top here, and then also between uh, some access panels at the bottom. If anybody's interested in trying the Avdec quick cure sealant, please uh, reach out to us. We'd be happy to to send you some samples of the, the Thixo Black TG2, TG3212 sealant to, uh, to play around with. In summary, aircraft corrosion is a never ending battle and does not stop for COVID-19. You know, corrosion can have a significant impact on your budgets and your return to, to service to time. You know, Avdec offers some unique and innovative corrosion prevention products. You know, a lot of the Avdec products were developed, you know, by talking to the people you know, in the hangars and in the MROs that are, you know, doing the work on the airplanes and kind of where they're struggling with different, you know, corrosion issues and then, you know, kind of going back and developing some, you know, unique solutions. You know, Avdec, you know, will provide product training on the installation of the product and then we'll also follow the life cycle of that, that solution to uh, ensure the corrosion prevention is achieved. Typically, we like to come out for, you know, one of the initial installations make sure the products installed correctly. And then when that airplane comes in for a heavy check or an inspection, we like to come back out and ensure that, you know, the desired corrosion prevention was, was achieved. You know, contact us today to talk about your uh, aircraft corrosion issues, or also if you'd like an, an Avdec catalog sent to you, we'd be happy to send you a sample of a catalog or sample of uh, Avdec's quick cure sealant. That, you know, the nice thing about the catalog, it's got samples of the Avdec product in the back so you can kind of touch and feel it, and uh, it really helps you understand how that technology works. I am included uh, some of the Avdec contact information. You know, we have uh, representatives covering uh, North America, Europe, and the Middle East. You know, the Asia Pacific, South America. We also have uh, someone dedicated to do an airline and MRO product training. We can come out and we can do a training on aircraft or in a classroom. We also have a, 
a special website we set up that has uh, product training that has videos of the, the different app deck products. After you go through that video, there's a quiz. And if you uh, successfully complete that quiz, you'll get a, a cert certification. If anybody uh, wants any information about our product training, please reach out to, to Sean for more information. We hope you found this information today uh, useful. You know, please uh, reach out to Avtech if you have any questions about the, the products that we discussed. Uh, we'd be happy to, to work with you on our, your different aircraft corrosion issues. Thank you for the time today.